hello guys so in this tutorial uh, I will add a hard disk then partition that hard disk uh, uh, after then uh, we will transfer the database and ASM software so to add the hard disk with that machine we need to turn off this machine my machine is going to down ok shutdown complete so we have to add hard disks add yes hard disks oh, is crazy. create new virtual hard disks uh, size will be 50 gigabyte single file and file name as also we have to provide the location file name will be ASM disk so finish and also have to increase the RAM 1 to 4 gigabyte processor to 2 okay now turn on the machine If you practice like this then you will get the totally real life flavor uh, in the workstation when you are going to working as a professional then you will got that flavor. is starting now till now is machine is starting So okay, uh, network card is up. We can log in by a putty terminal. Uh, let me save it. A A S M. F D S minus L by that command. Uh, you can verify the attached hard disks with that machine so in that machine there are two attached hard disks one is SDA another is SDB 53 gigabyte which uh, which I have just uh, well attached just right now so let me create the partition so before that we have to transfer the software so let me uh, create a directory soft under slash connect uh, this is the win scp software and you know uh, this is the very popular software to transfer the file from windows to linux So, uh, 
a full database we need all those things so with software is transferring and it will take uh, 15 to 20 minutes so uh, with that time in that time we will create the partition f disk minus f disk slash def slash sdb put the partition and extended partition on our permission first uh, with the entire disk i am creating extended partition then create logical partition plus plus 10 gigabyte again l plus 10 gigabyte l 10 gigabyte l 10 gigabyte so just right now I have created four partition let me show you if dis minus l so this is the brand new created partition so uh, software is still now transferring so after that I have to uh, what is the problem why the network is so software is let me troubleshoot it first okay it's okay it's connecting so software is transferring so it will take 20 to 15 minutes so till then I have to do nothing so to reduce the video length I am going to pause the video and I have to troubleshoot uh, what's actually the problem uh, might be my network adapter is not performing well so software is transferring so it's almost finished uh, till then uh, Okay. CD slash software CD slash ASM CD slash so this is the uh, packages which is required for ASM ASM disk group so RPM minus IVH Oracle ASM star you must have to install these packages in sequentially so if you don't know the sequence then it, it is better uh, put it just oracle asm and it will uh, install that that packages in sequentially okay installation done 
so f disk minus l this is the disk so before that i have to give the command init.t oracle asm config configured okay so uh, default user owned or user will be oracle so group group will be dba yes yes and now so asm is configured for user and groups now we have to create the asm disk group create -E create disk data one and volume will be sdb5 created sd6 for data 2 sd7 fra fra 1 sd7 for sd8 for fra2 so this is created so how we can verify that that disk is disk is created so by this command it is in it or the oracle asm list disk so this is the disk so disk is created software is also transferred so now we have to unzip the software and also you must have to unzip that software in sequential manner increase the font size either it will not be clear in the video 14 bold now ok Let me do this in the host machine. software on jeep on jeep 2 
actually uh, laptop is can't take the load load is such high look CPU 40% memory 71 disk is 80% Close the menu CPU software. PS minus EF grip. No such load. Okay, it's done. Now we will do on Jeep last one. And this one is also for grid infra grid infrastructure software. So once the unjib is complete, then zip file is no longer needed for me. Then uh, after the unjib, then I will uh, remove the zip file. minus rf star so anjib is done now i am going to remove the all this related file so all zip or software is removed rm minus rf also asm okay now giving permission to oracle use all user that execute that file it's done so now i am going to uh, in the next video uh, i am going to install the grid infrastructure software because uh, Linux machine is installed, environment also set it, ASM disk also created, software also transferred and unzipped. So now I am going to, uh, in next video, I will do, I will install grid infrastructure software. So thank you, thank you for watching.